What's up YouTube, this is Chris with Trust 360 and today I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to get the Gears of War 3 Beta VIP access for free. Um, before we get started, uh, just to let you guys know, um, there has been some rumors that people have been getting banned from the Gears of War 3 Beta servers. Um, this has not been confirmed by me in any way. Um, I've All my friends have been playing this ever since last Friday and none of them have been banned. I've actually not personally played this because... Yes, I'm a modder. Yes, I should be able to do do things, but I actually have Bulletstorm Epic Edition, which, as you can see, play Bulletstorm. I have Bulletstorm Epic Edition, which allows me to actually play the beta because when I bought that, it, it gave me uh, VIP access to the beta when it released. So to do this, um, you're going to need a USB stick. So we're going to go over here to System Settings and go under Memory, and we'll go ahead and wait for our devices to show up. So as you can see, if you have a USB stick, and it should say USB Storage Device. Or whatever, we're going to click on that and click configure now and then click yes. What this is going to do is going to run through some tests and actually configure your USB device. That way you can move Xbox 360 storage to it. So while it does this, I'm going to let you guys know it's been a week since I actually had my wisdom teeth removed. All four of them got cut out. Pretty bad, very painful. But uh, one great thing about that is I'm done now. And one bad thing is whenever I eat, my mouth bleeds. So it's kind of random, but... Uh, It'll all be over soon, hopefully, and uh, that'll all be behind me, and I won't be through any any pain at all after this. So, um, when it's done with uh, testing and configuring, it shouldn't take but about maybe 45 seconds to a minute maximum. And uh, if your Xbox, uh, not your Xbox, excuse me, your USB device actually fits all the requirements, it'll say your device is ready and meets Xbox 360 performance recommendations. So just go ahead and click OK. And you should have, uh, I have a 2 gigabyte, so it actually takes about 700 megabytes. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and go to your hard drive and you're just going to move something over. So I'm going to move gamer pictures over. What this actually does is this creates the content section onto your USB stick. That way you can easily add the Gears of War 3 beta into the USB stick and move it back to your hard drive without any problems at all. So what we're going to do now is we're going to switch over to the Xbox uh, and go get to the computer part of this tutorial. What's up guys, um, this is Chris, welcome to the computer part of this tutorial. So before we get started with this part, you're going to need to download the link in the description. There's actually two links, uh, one, actually three links I believe. One for my application, XB360 model version 5.0. One for USB XTAP 44, which is the same as really XB360 model version 5.0, except if you cannot download it or do not want to download the full application, you can download that application separately. And also the download to the Gears of War 3 beta. So what we're going to do, we're going to get our uh, USB stick out of our Xbox and then plug it in. So let me do that now. So there we go, it's plugged in. And uh, I'm going to close this. And I'm going to start up my XP360 Modern. Now this is an application that I actually created myself. Uh, so to sign into this, um, if you're not familiar with my actually my website and stuff like that, you're going to need to create an account. Go and click Login. Um, if you get to this far, this far, you have it downloaded, click Login Options, you should be able to create an account from there. So uh, if it's correct, it's going to say you're signed in, so just click OK. And when, whenever this loads up, we're going to go under Device Explorers. This is what we're going to use to actually explore our USB stick, which is USB X staff. So just click on the big USB stick there. So once this loads up, what we're going to do, we're going to click File. And we're going to go to Open Device Selector. And as you can see, there's nothing really showing up. So I'm going to go ahead and unplug my USB stick. And I'm going to plug it back in and maybe see if that helps it. So, close this, maybe close this out and open this back up. There we go. So now it's registered. Sorry about that delay, guys. So we can click Open Drive, and as you can see, our data partition has a plus side beside it now. So we can click that, and as you can see, what we moved over created the content folder and also the all zeros folder. So right here is actually our gamer pictures. So as you can see, here's our gamer pictures. So once you have the file downloaded, it should be this, which is WinRAR. So if you don't have WinRAR, there will be a link in the description for that. So go ahead and click extract here, and this is going to extract the uh, beta on your desktop into an actual Gears of War 3 beta folder. So once you have this, just go ahead and go in here. And what this is going to do is going to have this 00080000 folder in a readme file. Go ahead and open the readme file, and go ahead and copy the text that is right here. So go ahead and click Control C. I'm going to go ahead and close this out, and go ahead and close this out as well. And what we're going to do, we're going to click on the all, all zeros folder right click inside here and click in, new folder and then we're going to go ahead and click control V to paste the text we just copied and click OK 
this is actually going to create the area that we need to actually put our beta into. So this is actually the the ID for game demos. So what you do now is you're going to right click inside here and click inject folder. We're going to go to our uh, desktop. We're going to go to the Gears War 3 beta and click on the 0008000 folder and click OK. And what this is going to do, this is going to move the whole folder in here. So as you can see, it says demos on the content title. So if you click on that, what you're going to do, you're going to maximize this, click on that, and here's the Gears of War 3 beta. Content title, Gears of War 3 beta. It should be around 88.1 megabytes. So now we're done on the computer part. Just go ahead and close out USB X tab. You can close out this application if you have it open. And I'm going to go ahead and get back on the Xbox and show you guys how to boot it up from there. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Xbox. Now all I'm going to do is show you guys how to move it from your USB stick onto your hard drive and how to play the actual beta. So what we're going to do is just go ahead and plug your USB stick back into your Xbox and go over to System Settings. So once over here, just click A and go to System Settings. Go down, click Memory. And you're going to go to your memory unit, which is your USB stick, and go under Game Demos. So as you can see, Gears of War 3 Beta is under Game Demos. So go ahead and click here, and I'm just going to copy it, so I'm going to leave it on my USB stick, just in case a friend comes over and he wants the beta. So I can just, instead of putting it back on my USB stick, I can just throw it right onto his hard drive. So go ahead and click on your hard drive, and it's going to copy the Gears of War 3 Beta launcher from your USB stick. So once it's completely copied, just go ahead and click B. And go ahead and back out all the way into the main screen of my Xbox. And I'm going to show you guys how to actually launch the game. So once you're out here, just go ahead and go to Game Library. And as you can see, Gears of War 3 Beta should be there. So click on it and it's going to say Play Game. So there you go, guys. There you are. There's VIP access to the Gears of War 3 Beta. So once you click Play Game, what it's going to do, you're going to have to download a 507 megabyte update. What this update does is actually downloads the game for you. The only thing that I'm giving you is the Gears of War 3 launcher. Um, this actually is just the launcher uh, that was given to, I think, Cody. Um, so, uh, big thanks to him for actually releasing this to us. Um, also, um, you might get banned. I'm not sure. This is not been confirmed. None of my friends have been banned, so I'm, I'm thinking it's a pretty good risk to take. I don't think you're going to get banned if you played Bulletstorm and you played if you played this beta. I'm pretty sure you're never going to get banned because they're going to think you have the Epic Edition. So yeah, Epic Games, hop off my D. This is uh, just ed educational purposes only, uh, so you can't really do anything to me. And to Microsoft, uh, I'm doing this for educational purposes only, so I'm protected under the Section 107 of the Copyright Act. So uh, Microsoft, Epic Games, get at me, hop off my D. I'll talk to you guys later. I hope you enjoyed.